Hey everyone, welcome to The Daily. Today is Thursday, December 22nd. I'm Greg Lawless here at MLSsoccer.com. It's been a busy 24 hours for transactions here in the league. We're going to start in Montreal, where the Impact have signed midfielder Felipe Martins, a Brazilian who's been spending the last couple of years in Switzerland, but has also played in Italy. In Philadelphia, two new signings coming up from Central America. Panamanian Gabriel Gomez, who starred in the Gold Cup for Panama, actually scored a goal against the United States, will join the Union in 2012, as will Porfirio Lopez, a left back from Costa Rica, who's on the books with a club in China, but has been with Alajuelense the last year, winning two titles down in Costa Rica. And finally, Chivas USA confirmed on Wednesday that they have signed Ecuadorian Osvaldo Minda. He's expected to run the midfield for the GOATs in 2012. No one ran the midfield for Fulham yesterday. Clint Dempsey and company had a really tough day against Manchester United. They lost 5-0 at home at Craven Cottage. Dempsey had a couple of chances to score but wasn't able to put them away. And if you haven't seen some of Man U's goals, make sure you check it out. Wayne Rooney with an incredible long-range blast. And Dimitar Berbatov finished off the day with a cool little heel flick. Staying in the EPL, some news about the goalkeepers. Aston Villa's Brad Guzan got another start, and the U.S. number two was unable to keep Arsenal at bay. They lost 2-1 to one at home. Tim Howard, however, got a clean sheet and a 1-0 victory for Everton. Today, Brad Friedel will be in the nets for Tottenham Hotspur. They host Chelsea in a huge match uh, at White Hart Lane. That game is at 3 p.m. Eastern time on ESPN2, so you can check that out. Brad Friedel, of course, retired from the U.S. men's national team, but there are some new guys who are trying to make their way under Jurgen Klinsmann. He called in his roster for the January camp, which was announced today. Check out MLSsoccer.com for the full uh, roster of names that will be out in Southern California for training, and then the two friendlies later on in the month. And as the year winds down here, there's lots going on on MLSsoccer.com as we st continue to count down the stories of the year. Yesterday we put up number 11. Today it'll be number 10, make sure you check that out. Also the best of 2011 rolls on. Today we've got the assist of the year. Lots of great helpers all season long. We picked our favorite. Don't forget to log on to vote for what you think deserved assist of the year. And later on, Extra Time Radio, our podcast will do the quiz show. I take on Simon Borg and Jason Seguini to find out who knows the most about MLS in 2011. You can get that on iTunes or Buzzsprout. That's it for The Daily. We'll talk to you tomorrow.